Hello everyone, this is Kurt from Thiebify. For this video, we're going to learn how to set up a scroll to roll anchor in your site. This is perfect for single page layouts where you'd like to showcase all your content. Here's some examples. For this example, we'll be using the Ultra Theme Wedding Skin. Here you'll see that when we click on the header menu, it'll automatically scroll through the site to the section it's anchored. And the cool thing about this feature is that it highlights the active link to the section you're scrolling. This makes it easier for users to see which part of the page they're viewing. You can also use the scroll to row feature only on certain header menu links. It doesn't necessarily have to be the entire menu. Here's an example of how we've set it as a button on the menu. When you click on the link, it'll automatically scroll down to a specific part of a page. This is very useful, especially when making landing pages. Now let's get started. For this tutorial, I'm using the Ultra theme, but note that the steps I'll be outlining will work with any Themeify theme since all our themes are built in with the Themeify Builder. Let's first by starting to create a page. I'll call it landing page. I'll set the sidebar options to no sidebar and content width to full width. And I'll hide the page title. But feel free to do whatever you'd like for in terms of the page options. And click publish. Now you'll see a nice blind clean canvas. I'm going to turn on the builder now. And I am going to import a builder layout. The layout that I'll be using is the app page 4. Alright, the first thing that I'll be doing is I'm going to click on this pencil icon, which is the row options. And under the row anchor, I'm going to input the text that I'd like to put as my anchor. And you'll also see this on the left hand corner, right here. You'll see how that's a place where I can easily refer to it, just in case I forget the text. Now I'm going to be doing this for almost all the rows. And make sure to remember the text that you'll be that you're putting in here. Because we'll be using it later on as we make our menu. Now that I've done all the rows, I'm going to save the builder, close it, and now go to the menu section of my dashboard. Now here I am going to create a new menu, I'm going to call it scroll to row. And this is probably one of the most important parts of this tutorial, is to make sure to go to the custom links area. Here, on the link, on the URL, you're going to input the number sign first and the exact text that you used a while ago for your anchor. On the link text, feel free to just add whatever you'd like. I'm just going to put the same exact one that I used as my scroll to row anchor. And do this for all the rows that you did for your site. I recommend always using lowercase when inputting the, the row anchors just because it is case sensitive and you wouldn't want to make a mistake. Now once you're finished, click save. And now go back to the pages and edit the page and scroll to the Themeify custom panel page options. 
here you'll see an option called custom menu. Select the menu that we just made and click update. Now when you look at the site on the front end, or the page, sorry, you'll see that the scroll tool anchor will work just like the examples that we showed a while ago. And that's how you set up a scroll to row anchor menu on your site. Thanks for watching.